First, I want to say happy Sunday to everybody. I usually don't do much on a Sunday. I try not to. I try to rest. But I wanted to answer this comment right here. A lot of you on here are helping me with doing my videos because you're, an, you know, you're asking so many questions and I don't mind answering them. However, this one here is, where can I find your story? This is what I want to share with you. I'm sharing my testimony of all that God did in my life. Unfortunately, an innocent man lost his life in my case. Not by my hands, not by my doing. Uh, I was never in the home. Uh, and what I'm telling you now is truth. And at the time when this happened, truth be told, and many of you out there, if you have been in a situation like this, you know the newspapers do not print the truth. They print to where you'll buy newspapers. There was so much that was stated about me and the other people that were involved in the case, and none of it was true. That's why you have people who take pleas, and that's why I sat for as long as I did, because I wasn't budging. And my lawyer knew that I was telling the truth, but our justice system is very corrupt. And I'll say that to anybody. It, it's not concerned about truth. They just want to put somebody away. They want to get somebody for what happened. I never uh, was in this home. I don't even know what happened with inside the home with his friend. But I know this, that four days later I was being arrested because what happened inside the home their friend died overnight. That's why I tell people, be very careful. I can't even drop somebody off and go pick them up because I was diagnosed with uh, PTSD and God answered prayers. One of the victim's relatives was just here not too long ago. She brought me flowers and we went to lunch. I'm very close with her till this day. She knows that I never hurt her brother. Um, I never got to meet him personally, but it was not the wrong place, wrong time. It was the right place, right time for me. However, uh, my first name is Valerie Gale, and I don't go by my last name on here, and I don't have to. My Facebook is. But if someone feels that they want to look up the case, you're more than welcome to. But some of the things that were printed were not the truth and really hurt me. But God gave me the strength to get through everything. So I hope that that answers your question. And if you have any more questions, please don't hesitate to ask. And I want to thank everybody for your support and your kind words. God bless you.